Subscribe and press the bell icon first to see the latest video. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and uh, my name is Rinku and I'm gonna teach you guys different technique for beginner and advanced level of art. Today we'll learn how to make a fish and for that what you need is a pencil, eraser, a marker and some paints. So let's get started with our beautiful fish. So I made a little curvy line on uh, my left side and from here what I'm gonna do I'm gonna make a high curve and we'll go all the way around and again I'm coming back over here and connecting the line to where we ended the curve very nice so now this is the entire body of our fish now we'll do the tail. So for the tail, I'm making a curvy line going up and it will go toward the right side a little bit. And we'll do the same thing over here. Another curvy line going down and then go in this way. Now from here, what I'm going to do, I'm going to make a couple of waves. One, two, three four there we go so you can if you have more space over here you can make more than um, four now we'll make some fins here so for the fin I'm making a curved line at the top very nice now I'm making again some wavy lines and connecting over here very good now we'll do the same thing at the bottom as well a curvy line going down and then we'll make a wavy line connecting over here very good now what I'm gonna do here for the head part I'm gonna make a curve which will come from bottom will go all the way here and it will not connect all the way up it will end over this area now I'm gonna make a eyes here so for the eyes making one big circle and I'm gonna make three little small circles inside We'll fill them later. Right now we'll keep it like this. And we'll make a cute smiley over here in the front. Very nice. Now I'm gonna make lines, curvy lines inside for the pattern. So one and two. And then we'll leave some gap here and make another two line one two there we go very good so this is pretty much it so we've done our sketching now we will color our fish but before coloring we'll just trace the outline over here with a permanent marker make sure it's permanent marker okay so I'm tracing the outline, go slowly and trace your entire fish. This fish is kind of um, look like a Nemo, I guess. So we can color it uh, orange and black, but if you want to color in a different color, like what is your favorite color fish? Of course, you can do that. So over here, I trace the tail. Now I'm gonna trace the fin here. Slowly make sure very careful when, when you do this curvy part. I'll make 
the smiley and for the eyes i'm making a circle so what i'm gonna do i just traced all the lines and then i'm gonna fill the gap in between those three circles and if you want to create some bubbles here you can create some bubbles i'm making a couple of bubbles there we go if you want to make the seaweeds you can just go make a curvy line come down here again go up make a curve line like a s and come down and make a couple of them to the left, couple of them to the right side. So it will look more fuller. There you go. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take my eraser and erase all those pencil lines I have inside the fish. But make sure when you will erase, before you erase, make sure it's totally dry. So you just check it that it's dry, otherwise it will smudge all over and it will destroy your fish. Okay, so. After this, we'll start doing our paints. So first I'm gonna take my orange and I'll start coloring from here. Make sure your colors stay inside. Do not go outside of the um, outlines. Okay, now see, I'm just filling the area over here, but I'm not going inside this line, this in between those two lines. I'm not going to go in there. I'm going to keep it white and i already have my outline with the black so i'm gonna keep it as it is so that's it now i'm done with the body part now i'll do the fin area so kids if you are interested uh, in my personal lesson please uh, visit my uh, website link and i put it in the description so for the fin i'm gonna take my orange do the same thing here go slowly when uh, you're going covering this area because this part is highly chance where your color go can go outside of your outline so go a little bit slower on that area So I'm done with the fin and now I'm doing my tail here. So for the tail, I'm using the same color, but I'm leaving some gap over the edge area, like around this area. So you don't have to follow any shape over here. You can just keep some gaps over there. And what we'll do, we'll add some black over there after we are done with the orange so see i'm done with the orange now i'm gonna take some black so i took my black and i'm going over this area and coloring over here with the black very nice great job guys so we're done with our fish now I took my blue and I'm coloring this bubble with my blue. So you can just uh, fill them in, that's all. Very nice. Now for the seaweed, we need some green. So I took my green and I'm gonna color from this side. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please uh, do subscribe to this channel so you don't miss any video which I upload every week. 
and if you like the video you can give it a thumbs up and you can share this video with your other friends or you can have a party with your friends when you have a party with your friends you can sit down and do some drawings well done guys so i have one more left for the seaweed let me know how you guys like this video and i'm gonna see you guys in our next episode bye bye Don't forget to like the channel, share the video and subscribe the channel.